It's Burger Mondays at Blue Frog, and this is the on. I'm gonna call it as it says on the menu, truffled. No, not truffled. Truffle flavored mushroom soup, and this looks like um, an Italian bread, which I think is focaccia, and then there is some croutons inside, and then this is the Aurora iced tea, and I'm waiting for my sunrise goddess. And then there's deep fried calamari that's just gonna pop up right here. The barbecue beef burger has arrived. So in this burger there is deep fried onions, cheddar, beef, and then under here, if I can get it under, slowly opening is caramelized onions with normal fries. And my sunrise goddess has arrived. It is very sweet, like fruit juice sweet. If you can't tell what this is, this is deep fried calamari. You know what it looks like? It looks like the squid died for a long, long time because look how like wrinkly it is. My burger arrived and I have it's called the jalapeno beef burger. And there's a jalapeno pickle there, and there's some salsa, some beef, avocado, and some onions. And I have it with sweet potato fries. And this calamari is like so tough. I was so right from when I said it before. Oh, so steamy, and it steamed up my GoPro. And having coconut chicken, and then it's lunch, fried tofu, and then deep fried uh, beans, curd. And then this is clay pot rice. And then, whoa, that's a whole lot of chicken. So, <laughs> hello. It's been a long time since I've done one of these metro kind of vlogs. It just happened again. It skipped two stations. So it was like, go to one and skip one and then go to next and skip one. So thank God they stopped at Shinjun University. I'm so glad they stopped. But like, seriously? Why do they have to like skip some stations? They skipped Liu Ye Men and Tao Ye, and that's like some people need to get off and get on and stuff. So I finally got onto Shenzhen University's campus, and now I'm walking up a hill. Like, so um, a colleague told me the way to go from the metro station, Shenzhen University. I couldn't find that small gate, so I must have went past it, or because of construction work, it was hidden. So I had to go through the main, uh, one of the main kind of small main gates, I guess you could say. And the path that sh the colleague said to go is kind of under construction. So I'm kind of taking a big detour and. I was not ready for this hill. My feet hurt right now, and uh, it is an adventure today. I finally found the building, and I finally found the room that I'm gonna have the exam. I'm gonna have the Chinese exam on the fourth floor. <laughs> so I have to climb four flights of stairs, hike a little mini mountain, and I don't think I'm ready. It's not very good mentality for before I start of a test basically but I found it and I'm going home and I'm gonna go and have Subway and then these pe these students I was gonna say kids these students are I'm guessing gonna go into their evening class <sighs> I forgot how it felt like to be a student but I'm so tired right now my legs feel like they're gonna fall off so Okay, the train's moving again now, but before it was like emergency stop mode for like a good two minutes and then the door opened up again, which now it's back to normal, thank god, but it could be because it's peak hour, peak, because everyone finishes work, it's 7.40. I just finished the test, the HSK test, 